Hi, I'm Brian Chris with AudioBiz, and today we're going to show you how to coordinate frequencies off-site using the wireless workbench software by Shure. Let's get started. So we have our inventory entered from our previous video explaining the inventory tab, and now we're going to go over to our frequency coordination tab. This is our RF environment, and the white lines signify where the current wireless microphone frequencies are. If we go into our channel summary and hit Manage Channels, Anything with a check mark will receive a new frequency, but if there's something you'd like to remain on its same frequency, you can simply uncheck it. We'll hit OK, and now we can see we have 27 channels to get new and two channels to remain current. We'll jump down to our TV channels, hit change TV channels there. Now here we can enter in our city, our state, and hit find postal code. It'll do a quick search, come up with a list of potential postal codes, and we can hit search. We can now see that it's populated the list with all of the TV stations in the area, as well as any public safety that's been grandfathered in. We'll hit save, and we can now see that all of this data shows up in our scan as these red bars. We'll now hit calculate new frequencies. It'll go through its process, and now we can see separated out by room, the different frequencies that have gone and any backup frequencies that were calculated as well. We hit deploy to inventory and when I do that pay attention to the lines here. Once it's finished we'll see them move to their new locations and we can hit OK. We'll close that down and go back into our inventory and now we can see our nice list here. Now to get these programmed in we can simply go up to reports, run an inventory report, just keep all of this stuff set to go and hit generate report. In just a few seconds it'll pop up with our report which we can customize with the show and customer information. I'll show you that in one second. And here it will show you all of the different frequencies as well as our backup list. This can either be printed or conveniently exported to PDF or CSV for use in Excel. If we go up to File and go to Show Properties, here's where we can enter in all of our venue information. We can send that off to our location, and we will be set to go with a pre-coordinated show. So that's how we do off-site frequency coordination with the Wireless Workbench 6 software by Sure. Until next time, I'm Brian Christ with AudioBiz, and thank you for watching.